This video is sponsored by gPortal. They host all of my servers and I have to say they are pretty awesome. You can save 10% with my link in the description. Subscribe for more Valheim. Okay, here we go. Number one, wraiths are weak to what kind of damage types? Is it A, fire and spirit, B, blunt and spirit, C, frost and spirit, or D, none of the above? Wraiths are weak to what kind of damage types? And I'm going to look over here at the answers. Let's see. I'm looking for the correct answer. And the first correct answer is Tolkis. Y'all Tolkis. A, fire and spirit. Oh. Wraiths are weak to both fire and spirit. Good job, really? Tolkis, taking an early wow. lead. Are you sure? That's what the Wikipedia yeah, I says. Think, <laughs> I didn't think they would take spirit damage. <laughs> no, they well, they take spirit damage, but it's white, not yellow. A oh. According to the wiki, it is yellow. So I, I would, I, I'll have to confirm that. But uh, yeah, I did mm, not test this I myself. They were spirit. <laughs> <laughs> the lore has been revealed. <laughs> can they be? Can they be weak to themselves? I'm not sure about that. Yeah, uh, that's why I always bait them into the uh, certling spawners. <laughs> 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 okay uh number two from the dead man runestone if you have ever come across this one you who pass remember me i am a man whose home was once in the mountains of midgard carried here when i thought to earn my rest to find a life after life in valheim there were blank of us before the gray dwarves came now Odin will not hear me, and the seas refuse me. Soon this stone will be all that remains. How many of them were there before the gray dwarves came? Was it A, 3, B, 5, C, 7, or D, 9? There were blank of us before the gray dwarves came. Ah, polishing up on my reading comprehension skills. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just guessing no idea <laughs> I remember reading it but it's been a long time since I found another one yeah mm. I almost typed like hundreds or thousands oh. because I thought it was something like that <laughs> I'm glad I didn't press I enter I remember it being six but that wasn't an option so I knew I was wrong <laughs> <laughs> well yep I see that every, it looks like most of you have tried to send in an answer here and it looks like the last answer by Gwen is the correct one. Uh -huh. There were seven nice. of us before seven. the gray dwarves came. Oh, the seven theme pops up everywhere. I should have known. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Gwen. It was kind of a hint, though. You know, seven dwarves. <laughs> <laughs> and, okay, question number three. This is from the Frostworms runestone. Let you who read me be aware of the Frostworms, one of the most ancient kins sprung from whose body? Were, they, were the Frostworms sprung from A. Odin's, B. Freya's, C. Ymir's, or D. Thor's body? Which of these were the Frostworms spawned from? And I see the answer started coming in once all the multiple choice answers were read and I got to the right answer. And the first correct answer is Morning Darkness with Ymir. Good job, Morning. I was already typing it. You were already <laughs> typing it. <That's> enough. <laughs> yeah, she actually typed it out. <laughs> all right. Question number four. The mountain wolf is immune to what damage type? Is it A, frost? B, poison, C, spirit, or D, none of the above. The mountain wolf is immune to what type of damage? And now I'm going to look over at the answers. And Vaste of the mountain wolf clan answered <laughs> spirit. Good job, Vaste. That is the correct answer. They are immune to spirit. I fair advantage, I judge. 
<laughs> All right. Question number five. When Odin appears in Valheim, what is he holding in his right hand? Is it A, a spear, B, a hammer, C, a sickle, or D, a stick? Let's see. When Odin appears in Valheim, what is he holding in his right hand? Let's see. A stick or staff will be uh, accepted for that last one because a uh -huh. stick or staff is the correct answer. And it looks like Tolkis with a typed out answer. Good job. I've seen this guy way too many times to forget. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, what other kind of answers did we get for I, that one? I was about to put staff and then he said spear and I was like, oh no, spear must be right. I just must have seen it wrong every time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's why I chose spear. I was wondering if someone would pick it. I, oh, and Gwen Aww. thought he had a sickle because, yeah, he kind of reminds me of death, you know, death at the background, you know, the Grim yeah, Reaper. Grim Reaper. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, Creepy. The, this, side note, the spear is his weapon, but when he appears, he usually appears as a gray wanderer with a staff. Yep. A staff. Uh, a, yep. Yep, I yep. said a stick, but I should have said a staff. But yeah, exactly. Okay. This next one will require you to type out the full answer. There are no multiple choice for this. So here we go. Number six. In order to craft the crystal battle axe, you need three different materials. What are the three different materials? You do not need to say how many, but if you can get all of the materials in the quantities, I'll give you a bonus point. But you just need to name the three different materials that are required to make the crystal battle axe. So let's see. I'm looking over here at the answers. See, morning says silver, crystal, and core wood. That's not correct. Vaste Ow. said silver, <laughs> crystal, and fine wood. That is not correct. Tolkis said crystal, ancient bark, and silver. Tolkis with the win Yay! again. <laughs> wow, Tolkis. <laughs> Awesome. On fire. On fire. Yeah. Let me give a little update on the nice. score as we end with question number six. Gwen with one, Morning with one, Vaste with one, Izzy and Canaris with zero, and Tolkis with three. Yeah. yeah. You need to get some correct answers if you're going to catch up to Tolkis here. Okay. Question number seven. The Fenring cultist is weak to what damage type? Is it A, spirit, B, poison? C, fire, or D, none of the above. The Fenring cultist is weak to what damage type? A, spirit, B, poison, C, fire, or D, none of the above. All right, let's see. Looking over at the answer, looks like Tolkis says that they are weak to fire, and Tolkis... <laughs> That must be why they keep killing you because they are actually <laughs> very resistant to fire. Forget if it's resistant or immune, but it's one of those two. Mm -hmm. ah. It makes sense because they do shoot fire at you. So it would be kind of weird if they were weak to fire. I was wondering. Yeah, yeah I thought fire at first. And I think that's what's getting me confused is that, no, that's probably what they're immune to. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Looking at it here, it, uh, just I have the page up. It does say that they are resistant to fire. Okay, I'm yeah. looking at all the mm. answers, and I don't see the correct answer, which is B, poison. Fenring cultists are guess. actually weak <laughs> what? to poison, so... What? Oh, yeah. Bring your poison I could have, I could have bet they were weak, weak to fire. Oh, no, they're, they're, they're resistant one. to fire. <laughs> yeah, because they, they cast fire at you. Yeah. Yeah, so, so what... Humans can make fire. They still burn. <laughs> well, and when you make the armor from them, right, you get the fire, uh, some resistance. fire resistance. Ah, uh. uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So swap out your what fire arrows for poison arrows next time oh, yeah. you go mm -hmm. into the frost caves, everybody. Uh, oh, well. So no correct answers there. So nobody getting any closer to Tolkis. Mm. <laughs> All right. Question number eight. I'm going to read the text from a rune stone. And it's quite long, so I will stop as soon as the correct answer is typed. What is this runestone referring to? 
Long ages ago, the world of Valheim was home to a race of proud and noble people, <laughs> and Morning Darkness is <laughs> really familiar with this because she already typed Draugr. Two options. Great wolves and Draugr. And quick on the keyboard, Morning. Good job. No, you have to understand. I when I do streaming on Twitch, like I'll go and find these runestones and like use my storyteller voice and read this runestone out every time. Yeah, because uh. I'm so I'm so obsessed with how how deep it is and how every single ruin currently in Valheim is based on the Draugr people before they were the undead. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And that's why that's really you find cool. that's why you find draugers in the mountains and the castles and you know. <laughs> yeah. Well, good job there. <laughs> All right. So question number nine. The growth in the tar pits is weak to what damage types? A frost and fire, B blunt and spirit, C blunt and fire, or D. D, none of the above. I'll read those out again in case anybody missed them. The growth is weak to what damage types? Fire and frost, blunt and spirit, blunt and fire, or none of the above. So let me look over here. I see. Da, da, da. Oh, right down to Gwen with the first correct answer. The growth okay. is weak to both blunt and fire. That's what you want to use when you're out there fighting the growths. In the tar pits. Hmm. Good job, Gwen. Yay. Woo, Gwen. All right. Well, we're coming down to question number 10. The last question. Gwen and Morning Darkness with both two. Tolkas has three. Can one of them answer correctly <clears throat> to catch up to Tolkas for the tiebreaker Come question? Come on, Gwen. We got to do this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Everybody's welcome to steal it, though, if they want. Or you could uh, not mm -hmm. type and let them try to challenge Tolkas. But... <laughs> This all bragging rights here anyway, so if you get the right answer, <laughs> go for it. Here we go. Final question, and you'll have to type out the answer here as well. In order to craft ice cream, you need two different materials. What are they? And if you can tell me exactly how many of each, I will give you a bonus point. In order to cast, uh, craft ice cream, you need two different materials. What are they? And I'm out. I'm <laughs> looking over uh, at the answers. Seriously. And Gwen. Uh, <laughs> woman power! <laughs> with gray dwarf eyes and freeze glands gets a point. And warning come answered with three eyes and one frost gland for the bonus point. Oh, oh well my done. goodness. <laughs> We have a three-way tie, so let's see who can answer the final tiebreaker <sighs> question to win it. So this is only for Gwen, Morning Darkness, and Tolkis for the tiebreaker. Here we go. On May the 4th, 2021, Jirok released a Star Wars parody video. Which Star Wars movie did he parody? On May the 4th of 2021, Jirok released a Star Wars parody video. Which Star Wars movie did he parody? I'll name the movies. Was it A, Star Wars? Some call it A New Hope, but that wasn't its original name. Was it B, The Empire Strikes Back? Or was it C, Return of the Jedi? Let's oh, look over here. And morning answers correctly with Empire Strikes Back. Yeah! <laughs> Star Wars. I took. I lost too much time there. Uh, yeah, you typed out Star Wars: The Empire Strikes Back, so that gave Morning time to get her answer in first. Uh, <laughs> yes! Congratulations, Morning Darkness is our champion this week. Woo -woo. Ooh, well done. That was a full title. <laughs> Honestly, this felt like a Valheim uh, class crash course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as Boste uh, pointed out, a, uni a unique winner e every week so far. Yeah, well, GG. Well played. GG <laughs> <laughs> <G> easy. <laughs> <laughs> Reported. <laughs> <laughs> 
you like Viking stuff, I like Viking stuff, well, you should check out my sponsor, The Grimfrost. They have thousands of modern and historical Viking products. So many cool things here on this website. And just use my link in the description. I'd like to give a huge shout out to my supporters, some of them on Patreon, the YouTube membership, and the ones who help boost our Discord server. Your support means the world to me and inspires me to make more videos, as well as run a community Discord and multiple Valheim gaming servers. If you enjoy my videos and would like to support my work, join our friendly Discord community and Valheim servers, links can be found in the description below. Skull!